action. You demand leaders with the political courage to do what is right. And we saw that last year when all of the NRA-backed bills were defeated, which is an enormous victory. Now, what brought me into this movement initially was Columbine. I was in high school when that happened, and it was an awakening and awareness uh, for me on the issue of gun violence and gun violence prevention. I also saw that as an educator. I have sat in classrooms with six-year-olds crouching under desks as someone pulled on the door, and they didn't know if that was an active shooter or their vice principal coming to make sure we were safe. There are common sense measures that we can take to keep our kids safe at school, which is why I'm proud that I have introduced a set of, uh, of measures that is bipartisan, uh, and I'm calling it my school safety suite. So the first two of those bills have already dropped. Uh, one of those would bring high school students and parents into the emergency response planning process in a more thorough way. And the other, HB 2075, would exempt school blueprints from public records requests. And this is a bill that needs your support we can get this heard, we can get it onto a committee agenda, it does already have bipartisan support. So please reach out to your state representatives, your state senators, uh, the education committee members, and let them know that this is a bill we're ready to move forward on to keep our kids safe. Thank you very much. Thank you.